I bet it's even in New York. It's far more civilized, that's for sure. Excellent, excellent. Well, New York is happy to have you there. The whole city. <laughs> Tiffany <laughs> Garson. Oh no. <laughs> oh. Woo! Wait a second. Oh. Tiffany, did you ever in your life, in your very brief time in this industry, <laughs> very brief. did you ever think you'd be sitting here at Comic Con? No, actually, I didn't. I didn't think so. <laughs> am, I, am I actually here? <laughs> You belong at Comic Con. <laughs> Timothy, yeah. the crimes that happen in white collar yeah. are often referred to as capers. Mm -hmm. Do you have a favorite caper so far? Oh, uh, do I have a favorite caper? <laughs> the question was for you. Go on. <laughs> Quite fun, where uh, Peter gets to go undercover. <laughs> yeah, yeah, under the covers. Will they giggle, giggle? Yeah. And on the set of my collar, occasionally, not often, but sometimes, people break out spontaneously in song. Never. That never happens. Break out in song? Yeah. Song? Yeah, quite often people break out in song. Yeah. Break out in dance. <laughs> dance. <laughs> tell them about the white collar cheer. Oh. <laughs> now, Matt Bomer. Yes. Have we met? No. Okay. <laughs> you know, you've been in the last season, you were fairly active, uh, jumping out of windows and things like that. Do you like doing your own stunts, or would you like me to continue doing it for you? <laughs> you've been amazing in such a super reply. I heard about the slip disc, and so I'd like to do them all on my own from here on out. Excellent. So, so there's a crack about my age. <laughs> and I'm fantastic. Any, any age can see this. <laughs> and you're such an exact match. So, um, Jeff Easton, yeah. one reviewer, I can't remember who that was. One reviewer said that the show was like Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid. Were you thinking of the buddy cop romance when you were writing White Cop? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I hadn't heard the word romance prior to that, but uh, yeah, yeah, Butch and Sundance, Briggs and Brooke Um Brooke back on. <laughs> <laughs> I have a question for you, Mother. Do you have a, a favorite scene from season one? A favorite scene? Mm -hmm. uh, you know, the first time I ever got to act like Mozzie thought he was in authority, I, I believe when I, we were. Uh, when Matt and I went to shake down the limo driver. Yes. I just, I, it was, there's such a little scene, but it's like any time Mozzie has to deal with actual other humans other than Matt, it's, it's really fun to play. One other question, do you ever read the full scripts? I've never read the <laughs> No, I, I do the show, I don't know if you all know this about uh, William Frawley, who played Fred Merce on I Love Lucy. Never read a script of I Love Lucy. So that's kind of how I do white collar. I have no idea what's going on. I just know my lines and most of my lines. Explains a few things. Yes. Jeff King, A, what do you do? And B, <laughs> what is a typical day on the set like at white collar? It's, it's joy from beginning to end because of this fabulous group of people. It's, it's the first shot of work that where everyone likes each other when they come to work. And they like each other at the end of the day, and it shows up in the, in the quality and the work that we do. 
And what I do is, is a, a mystery to me. So. <laughs> that just shows what good actors we are. We, just, we like each other so much. Keep believing that. No. <laughs> Don't tell me it's not true. It's true. Okay, it's true. It's true. Uh, Tiffany Garson. Um, <laughs> apparently, you recently had a baby. We heard. Experience been like uh, because you know as as weird as it seems we we had just started this family yes and then you added to your actual family <laughs> and it must, yes. have been, it must have been a very strange experience. Um, well, getting pregnant or having birth or what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. No. <laughs> um, no, actually, yeah, I, I I got pregnant in the first season. Um, I think we finished uh, season one when I was almost four months pregnant. Hiding it, um, and then uh, and then yeah, I've actually been away from these guys. I miss these guys a lot. I've been here in Los Angeles and I've been in New York. So um, I had to shoot all, all my scenes uh, here in Los Angeles um, for the first like six episodes, I think it was. And so I leave the next week and meet up with these guys again, and I'm excited. So it's gonna be. Uh, previous episodes of like the shot at completion. Yeah. 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 And Harper's going to be a new FBI agent. Yeah. She is. Uh, yeah. She is. She a baby, baby, in, a, a baby in a shoulder bolster is very common. She's doing a lot of other work. A lot of other work. Yeah. No one's going to suspect her. She's actually perfect. Marsha Ann Thomason. I don't know if you're going to leave me saying that. Um, are you indeed from England? I, yes, that's indeed. That's not the question. Uh, that's not the question. Uh, you, you returned to us this year yes. as a regular. Yes. Um, were you excited to return to us? No. Okay. <laughs> Okay, tell us. No, it was when the first scene that we had where Peter and Diana meet on the park bench. Right. And we just sat down and we rehearsed the scene once and it just felt like, oh, this is right back to home. It felt exactly what I was going to say. It felt like coming home. It was really great. It was nice. Yeah, it was lovely. Oh, that's great. Oh, my God.